For centuries, fish are reported to have fallen from the sky, and science tells us water spouts are the cause. Is this really what's going on? I'm Brian Dunning, and you're watching In Fact. Welcome to the show that brings you the real facts behind popular myths. Even today, it occasionally pops up in the news. Fish fell out of the sky onto a village in India or a golf course in Florida. How can such a thing be? The news tells us that too. Water spouts from a storm at sea suck fish up out of the water, carry them inland on strong high altitude winds, and drop them inland far away from the storm. And for some reason, people have been believing this. Here's the real story. The fish don't fall from the sky, and water spouts don't have any ability to lift anything and there's no magical horizontal conveyor belt in the upper atmosphere for fish or anything else. The visible column of a tornadic water spout is not an upward flowing elevator of water. Even the ultimate suction of a pure vacuum can only lift water about 10 meters and it requires a solid walled tube to do so. The water spout's column is simply water vapor which collects in the center because it's less dense than air. The winds in a water spout move around horizontally, not vertically. Below the surface of the water, nothing is disturbed. People snorkeling have had water spouts travel right over them and not even been aware that anything happened. Nothing reached down into the water, lifted them, and hoisted them aloft. There's always been a simpler explanation, one for which plenty of hard evidence has always been abundant. The fish were already on the ground and seeing them out of place, a person assumed that they had to have fallen out of the sky. Many fish, surprisingly, do travel over dry ground. There are several species of walking catfish, native to Southeast Asia, but now an invasive species worldwide, including the United States. It crosses dry land to find food or better habitats. There are 32 species of mud skippers worldwide that come out of the water to feed and court. But the kings of fishfall reports are the 34 species of climbing perch found throughout Asia and Africa. They have a small chamber that acts like a lung and they walk using their gill plates. And most people haven't heard of these, and when you come upon a group of catfish or perch in the middle of a field, the next thing you know is that someone has called the newspapers to report fish falling out of the sky. I'm Brian Dunning, and this has been In Fact. In Fact is made possible by financial support from viewers like you. Please visit InFactVideo.com.